Hey guys, what's up? It's Lena here, one half of the Shinola channel group. And I am back with a review for this new show that premiered tonight, June 26th. Best friends whenever. It's about two best friends who literally can time travel. Now, um, this show was actually pretty good. I didn't know if it was gonna be good or not, but I actually ended up liking it. And it stars Lauren Taylor. She plays Shelby, like the best friend who's kind of a little bit controlled. Not controlling, but she likes things in order. Then you got Sid, who's played by Landry Bender. And she's the other best friend. Her parents went to Peru for like, uh, uh, Shelby said maybe like, they so probably moved for like three years. And she actually moved in with her best friend into her house. It's kind of like how, um... In the bedroom reminds me of a little bit of a, like a drinking Josh bedroom, you know, like the bar upstairs. But then it kind of reminds me like a the good luck Charlie bedroom. But it's like a little Hannah Montana bedroom too, like the, from the new season, newer seasons, from the like the later on seasons. But like the bedroom looks like a mixture of different bedrooms, but it's a really cool bedroom. And I'm talking about the bedroom. But anyway, um, yeah. But uh, Sid's parents is gone, so she moved in with her best friend Shelby, and now they go to school together, and they can time travel because it's this boy named Barry. He he got his own uh science lab. And he's like a scientist and stuff. And Barry's played by um, Gus Camp plays Barry the actor. And he do scientist stuff. And then you got Naldo, which is um Ricky. The guy's name is Ricky Garcia. And he's like the guy. He's not really that good of a scientist. He's kind of like the maybe like I kind of feel just from this one episode like like the goofy character because they had like a a, 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 ch a hair growing machine. And he was like, why do you want chest hair? And he was like, cause I just want to shave it off again. So then you got um, uh, Shelby got two twin brothers, uh, Brett and Chad. They played by Benjamin Royer and Matthew Royer. They're both real twins in real life. And then you had um, Marcy. Her name, her real name is Madison. Who I'm almost saying that right. Who and she was on there. And her character is a little weird, kind of. But it's like she's like really happy, enjoying, lucky and stuff. And how they got the time travel is. Barry's one of Barry's gadgets, his laser lays off, beamed onto another thing, and shot down on um, Shelby and Sid. So now they can time travel. Whenever they touch, they time travel. Whenever they touch and say something, they figured out how it was because Shelby was trying to ask this guy named Cameron, who's played by Emery Kelly, and um, Emery Kelly plays Cameron, and um, he, he she was trying to ask Cameron to dance, but she messed up. So she's like, she's gonna redo it again because she they saw how they was time traveling. So she tried to redo it again, but then she met. But then Sid ended up asking, not really asking, but she was right there when the question was answered, asked. So then they then they went to the future somehow. They went two years into future in twenty seventeen, and um, Marcy told them that they wasn't friends anymore because Shelby got mad at Sid because Sid. With thought, she thought Sid asked him on a date, and her and Marcy became best friends. So it kind of showed, and Sid moved out of that place. So it kind of showed how Shelby, Shelby saw that she was probably being controlling a little bit too much, and she wanted to fix it. And then they went back out into back into the past, and they tried to fix it again with her asking Cameron now, but it really wasn't working, and it really wasn't working. And Mar Marcy ended up just asking him, and it was I guess it was fine with that. But um, it's a pretty cool show for the most part. Um, I thought it was gonna be a little annoying, but it really wasn't. It was really funny. The girl who plays Sid, I was, she looked really, really familiar, so I looked it up. And she was in that Jonah Hill movie, The Sitter, which was really funny, because she was a little girl. I was like cursing and stuff. I was wearing the tutus and stuff, and cursing and fighting. And that was really cool. And um, yeah, so it was, it's a really good, cool and good movie. Um, I like it. I mean, not movie, sorry, TV show. Um, I like it. I don't know if I'm doing a review for it every week. I might do it every, I just I said this before. I might do it every other week, but it's a chance I can do it for next week. Um, the full show will premiere July 12th. The date, um, the time is going to be like, I think, 8.30 on Sundays, which I think they bumping Casey undercover up to maybe 7 o'clock, maybe. I don't know for sure, but they got a new time slot now. It's, it's at 8 where Casey undercover usually be at. So, I don't know where Casey undercover time slot's going to go, but that's not it. But um, for the most part, it's a good show. I like it. It was pretty funny, and I really want to see next week to see how much and more it improves because they they time traveling and it's pretty cool so um yeah it's a pretty cool show i think they time travel and they have to touch hands uh and touch each other and say where they want to go and that's how they time travel and they're gonna tell barry and barry's gonna try to fix it somehow but um uh that was it guys thanks for watching this review like share subscribe comment this video so, no, no, no. today i'm from the cast 
Um, it's gonna be down below in the description, and all my social media is gonna be down below in the description. So follow me down in the box down at the descriptions, and I'm gonna probably put their names in the box on the side of me. I might or might not do it, but I'm gonna do it. And um, congratulations to all the actors who got casted in this show, and hopefully it do good because the first episode seemed pretty good. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go see the ratings and see what how it goes. But uh, bye guys. Thanks for watching this review of this new show. It premiered today, June 26th. Tonight, it premiered tonight along with Teen Beach, movie, Teen Beach 2, which I did a view and y'all can go check that out. And it came on with a case and a cover episode that, and that was at a new time slot too. So, um, bye. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.